Natural disasters impact millions of Americans each year, and while donations and support get smaller over time, damage from the disasters can linger for months or even years. June is the beginning of a new hurricane season, and it's important to support those impacted in years past. Here to tell us more about it is the CEO of Team Rubicon, Jake Wood. Welcome, Jake. Hi there. Thank you for having me. I'm happy to have you here. Tell me a little bit more. What exactly is Team Rubicon? Sure. Team Rubicon is a nonprofit organization, and we focus on recruiting and retraining military veterans to respond to disasters. So we have a, a network of about 100,000 volunteers, mostly military veterans across the U.S., and we deploy them into communities to help uh, those communities prepare, respond, and recover from disasters. Really amazing. You have a campaign. It's called Fueling the Frontline Campaign. What is that campaign all about? Sure. So Fueling the Front Lines is a, a partnership with one of our corporate partners, Jack Link's Beef Jerky. And we run it every June, uh, which, you say, as you said, coincides with uh, the beginning of hurricane season. And it's really about how do we drive awareness to the public about the, the long-term impacts of these disasters. You know, it's often easy for us to think that, uh, you know, the disasters last one or two days and then, you know, we move on with our lives. But it's really important for people to know that it takes months and sometimes years for some of these communities to get back on their feet and fully recovered. And when you're talking about the lasting effects of these natural disasters, you're talking about what? Rebuilding, cleaning up, infrastructure? What exactly is the, uh, that they're rebuilding there? Sure, it's really all of the above. I mean, these, these disasters, they, they damage or destroy homes. They force small businesses to shut down. Really, the fabric of some of these communities just gets completely ripped apart. So you have these, these families that are trying to get back into their homes. You have business owners that are trying to, you know, get insurance payments so they can reopen for business. And, you know, that can draw out for, for years. And so how can people get involved? How can we help? Sure. Well, Fueling the Front Lines is one of the campaigns that we're running uh, on June 12, which is National Jerky Day. Uh, uh, customers can go in and, and buy uh, a bag of, of Jack Link's beef jerky. For every bag that's sold, Jack Link's will donate one to Team Rubicon and the communities that we serve, in essence, fueling the front lines. And if people go online uh, to the website, uh, jacklinks.com slash uh, our cause, they can donate and Jack Link's will match those contributions, those donations, dollar for dollar. Really amazing stuff. And if we want to get more information on Team Rubicon itself, where should we go for that? Yeah, if people want to learn more or volunteer with Team Rubicon, they can go to teamrubiconusa.org. Tons of great information on there. All right. Thank you so much, Jake. We really appreciate you being here. And we'll be right back with more Midday Maryland right after this. Stay tuned.